Again, we're sitting here with good old Davo, and we're uh, we're just taking in the beautiful scenery. And I wanted to ask you, do you have kind of any further thoughts that have been percolating in that old head of yours? Yeah, um, kind of a worldview idea, and uh, the basic idea of uh, sustainability. We'll just go to sustainability. Uh, people, profit, planet. I think that's a very good effort, a very good um, program. You know, green reporting. Um, green reporting can be when it's when it's used for uh, being a turning factor on uh, global investment and things like that. I think that can be. Uh, Ideal is generally a good a good idea. I think we can do better uh, by looking at what I would I would I would term as regeneration. Regeneration is the concept that uh, everything that's alive needs to duplicate. It needs to regenerate. It needs to grow. It needs to it needs offspring. Best old companies have figured out ways to survive. Uh, they figured out ways to uh, open up new markets. Uh, people are designed to uh, explore, or designed to create, or designed to uh, go where others, or others have. No others have gone before. That's that's what we're supposed to do. And. Um, emerge and change over time. Languages emerge, change over time. Laws, uh, laws emerge. And so basically truth emerges. Uh, what was true a hundred years ago is obsolete today. So truth itself emerges. Well, then can you kind of explain to us just a little bit more what your truth is? What kind of makes you tick? That's interesting. My truth is, I can define that as, my truth is making sure that you know what your truth is. Um, we're here, this is easy. Independence is great. Independence is, uh, is definitely needed to sharpen your personal skills. Learn how to apply yourself. Uh, know who you are and how you, how you can interact with the group, but interdependence is absolutely necessary. You're not a communist if you write in schools. You're not a socialist if you ride you know, your car on a blacktop and I would be shared between states. You know, drop, we need to drop these damn ridiculous uh, judgments. Convenience to make our simple arguments and snippets of time, you know, on the camera. And we need to get to a, a mindset of interdependence, you know, coupled with independence. And for the for the purpose of of creating outcomes that are going to benefit people, people need to be developed. Their minds need to be developed so we can access resources that we don't even know that we need yet. Um, you know, ultimately, I don't care if you think I'm out there, but I think we're supposed to go out there. You know, I've, I've been reading the Bible since I was a little kid, and God promised Abraham, you know, that his, his offspring would be as numerous as the stars. So, I'm reading through a gene rod. Let's, let's learn how to get out there. Um, and we're, 
going to need everybody to chip in with that. So, you should any plane or any person for granted. We don't know who the next Einstein is. We don't know who the next, you know, Tesla is. So. Perfect. So, tell me, what are specifically some of your steps that you can move us and yourself into that? out there that you're describing? Uh, I'm looking at this as three main, uh, three main areas, and they all have to do with knowledge. It's, it's definable as how we're utilizing knowledge. Uh, and it's, for me, that's, we're using knowledge commercially. That's everything that we know that we use to figure out what we need to survive, to gain, to live. Um, there's, there's, uh, so knowledge and commercial knowledge, and there's uh, academic knowledge, uh, which is what we're learning, what we're applying as far as our, our laws, our statutes, our policies, our programs. ideals, ideology, it comes in the form of, oh, good God, it comes in the form of uh, Sunday school, or it comes in the form of uh, preschool, college, it comes in the form of uh, working, you know, at the mill, it comes in the, anywhere you, anywhere you can learn a skill, uh, understand how ideas become applicable, um, and, and your behavior is adaptable in society, um, that is knowledge. And the, the, the purpose of knowledge is to build society. I mean, we, that's where I come back to independence and interdependence. Where society is based on interdependence. We need good laws. We need laws that are, are useful and serviceable. That's why they always have to change because eventually you get cash cow. Uh, you have cash cow phenomenon in commerce. You, see, you, you, you have the same thing in governance. Um, people that know how to use laws to get stuff abuse that also. So, what's some specific knowledge that you have used in your own life to kind of further your own thoughts? to further your own teachings, to further yourself as a whole? Uh, I would say as far as knowledge, uh, my, the disciplines that I gravitated toward in school, college, were uh, management or organization development. Um, that gives you a broad, uh, wide, big picture view of, of companies and organizations and how people and, and skill sets are used to uh, and applied toward uh, 
making the company profitable and ethical. So um, it will be management organization development. Um, knowledge is uh, that's I mean that's that's a skill set that I greatly enjoy. Uh, I went on to to develop a business model or an innovative product um, that I have a concept for and uh, project management and, and uh, uh, operations as a, as a skill uh, knowledge set that I learned at Lawrence Tech and I got an MBA there as well. Um, somewhere along the line I figured out that it's not going to help me to push on getting a new product development, a product developed, um, you know, that's, that's something that engineers do. Um, you need a good business model to, to sell the product concept and identify the, uh, the markets, you identify different uh, lead users, you identify the investors, you identify, you know, every aspect of the program, and then uh, with that knowledge, you can have a more successful product launch. Uh, so, I really think that the studies that I've done in business innovation and business modeling, coupled with the experiences that I got from uh, back when I made six figures even before. just about enough for this segment, so join us next time when we delve a little further into the teachings of Dave. We're gonna ask me something. <laughs> 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 <laughs>